guys and welcome to another Whitney's Wonders. So today I decided to pull out the old Final Fantasy 7 for my Sony PlayStation 1 and I am going to show you how to access the Materia Caves side area and get all four Materia Caves. So after you've bred a uh, gold chocobo you can reach secret materia caves that are scattered across Final Fantasy VII. Um, of course, the green and blue chocobos can visit some of the caves, but the gold one can go to all. Plus, I feel like to get the full Final Fantasy VII experience, you should grind and get a, uh, a gold chocobo. Um, it's very expensive, it's time consuming, but I have put in the work already. So, we are going to go to the Chocobo Ranch. and get my gold chocobo. So I've named him Felix. I named all the chocobos after people, like the cats and people that I know. Okay, so we're going to start with, we'll go backwards. We'll start with number four then. Um, and this is how you can put your map on. You can just follow me where I'm going. It's way across the full map over to the other side, number four. see my little red dot too that just shows you where you are on the map and where you leave your vehicles so we should be coming up to it soon somewhere around right here okay so let's go in We got the mine materia. And then that disappears. So we'll go back out. Get back on. And we're going to proceed to number three, which isn't too far from here. our HPMP. And we'll get back on. And we're going to go to Materia Cave number two, which is now back across down here. Pretty much past the ranch again. It should be there. We go. That's our Quadra Magic Materia. Now 
let's get back on and we'll go to the last materia cave which is essentially number one they call it but we went backwards and there's up here here. Somewhere around here. A little bit farther down. I know it's there somewhere. Goblins right up here should be. It's not usually this far off. Ah, found it. And here's cave number one, right up the top right there of the map. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is where you're going to get the all-powerful, important Knights of the Round materia. Now let me get to a battle. I'll equip it. Put the cave back down this way. Stop here. Okay, in here for now. Anywhere. Now it uses up quite a bit of HP. So we'll get into a battle now. So we just move in Final Fantasy VII and then a battle will initiate. And this is where I will show you what the Knights of the Round materia looks like. I think it's about a minute and a half that it runs fully. Well, that might kill that guy now. Okay, so we'll go to Summon. And we'll go to Knights of the Round, put it on him, and enjoy, ladies and gentlemen. Look at those PlayStation 1 graphics. that so there you go ladies and gents that is how to access the materia caves in final fantasy 7 for the playstation 1 
after I finish this game, actually, I might even break out the remake as well. Played on, uh, we recently just got a PlayStation 5, so might play it on there and pull that out, but might do some other Final Fantasy 7 um, material as well, just to show you where some things are. I know sometimes people get lost, especially games like this, RPG games. Um, there's a lot to do. I probably put in like a couple hours worth of just training and racing chocobos just to get that video quick that I just showed you. So it's been a lot of time, but I'm going to finish the uh, third disc of the game and everybody enjoy. That's another Whitney's Wonders. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe.